Hey, what's going on, guys? James here, bringing you guys um, another tutorial. This one's gonna be how to code a sprint hack. And what the sprint hack is is it's pretty much just like a fly, except um, you're not actually flying. You're you're walking, but well, actually, it's not really like a fly. It's more like you're flying on the ground, but like you're flying really fast. So. Um, the good thing about this is um, it's undetectable by servers. I've tried it, and if they do have a have um, a, a plugin to stop it, um, which they probably won't, then that's the only way it'll be detectable. But usually they don't have that because if they do, that means they have to pretty much block out sprinting in general. So even if you don't have a hack, the sprint will still be blocked by that plugin. So anyway, um, let's just get right into it. Um, first off, hold on, let me close all this. You don't need any of this. Go to your variables class, and you're going to want to make a new static boolean. So static boolean, I'm just going to call it run. And false. All right and then we can go back into our GUI in game make ourselves a check key so check key keyboard dot key underscore uh, let's just use I and then we'll open it up with a squiggly bracket variables dot um, run equals exclamation point variables dot run all right oh and then don't forget your ending semicolon all right so after that you're going to want to go into your client um src uh oops net dot minecraft dot src and then after that there should be um entity player so we're gonna go into entity player let's see um all right, more down entity player all right so entity player dot java double click on that should open up and then after that uh hold on let me check in my other client because this is where i usually keep everything my senator client um all right so you're going to want to press control and F and search for jump all right so the first thing it should be it'll have this land movement factor all that so it is sprinting you see and let's see what I did here um okay I get it so once um, you're here, right under the first opening squiggly bracket, you're gonna put an if statement, variables dot run, and you're gonna want to copy this, paste that in here, and I'll explain all this in a moment. And then you're gonna want to change that 0 0.2 to a 0 0.9 and same with this 0 0.9 all right oh wait hold on I think I'm forgetting something this should be like an exhaustion thing over here um let's see hold on run run all right so should be under your where is it Okay, never mind. Uh, we're gonna go back into. Um, oh wait, okay. You you guys are already here. Never mind. So um, after you pasted that in and put all the nines in, uh, we're gonna search for um, public void jump. Okay, that's not found. Okay, never mind. Let's just search for exhaustion and. let me see hold on 
I'm sorry guys. It's it's hard for me to remember all this. Um public will jump. If it is sprinting. Um, I apologize guys. I really do. Exhaust exhaust okay. Okay, we are here. Um so is sprinting else um right after that I think we put a if statement. Okay, okay, I get I get it. Alright, so uh once you search for exhaustion, you should get something like this that says add exhaustion zero point eight F and right under it zero point two. Uh right after the um opening squiggly bracket we're gonna put an if statement variables dot run and like I said I'm gonna explain all this in a moment add exhaustion and what did I put here I think I put 20 or something yeah 20 20 F semicolon then what else did I put alright I think it's it. yeah okay now I can explain to you guys so if I go back up to here I think that's where it is okay so uh, the reason why you put this in that means um, every time you toggle the run which we made an activator for that'll toggle all this which means that your your speed when you're on the ground is going to be like the highest speed which is 0 0.9999 or whatever and then when you're jumping or like when you're in the air you're still going to be moving you're going to be jump you're going to be able to jump like really far so it's 0 0.99 you know so after that um here for the exhaustion you didn't really have to put this um it's just good to have so that when you're running you never get exhausted cuz if you see in in the regular Minecraft um you would be able to run like maybe maybe like um what do you call that um uh, maybe like 5 seconds or more I don't know but uh, when you have the exhaustion up to 20 you won't get exhausted at all plus um, this doesn't lower your hunger bar it'll be like you're running or it'll be like regular running so you don't have to worry about that so anyway after all that explaining control and S to save it we can go back to our GUI in game and let's just add it to the menu because I forgot to do that so variables dot run um, open it up. Oops. Variable. Okay. Open it up. Font renderer. Dot draw string with sh shadow. And I'm actually gonna copy that so that I don't have to rewrite it. Um. Oh. What did I put? I equals twenty-four-seven-four. Hmm. Sprint twenty four seven F equals off and then two and like I said it always goes up by twelve so now it's eighty no eighty four zero X F F F F F F Alright and then else boom I equals slash twenty four seven two oops wait a minute guys okay so this one is two and then this one is twenty four seven four okay sprint slash twenty four seven F equals off okay this one's on I'm s I'm getting confused today I don't know why two 84 0 x f f f f f f oops all right finally we are done so now let's run our client 
and um how much time do I have okay so um also if you guys want um I might do um something special for my if or if I get 30 what do you call that 30 uh, subscribers if I do um if you guys want a tutorial like a specific tutorial leave it in the comment section and don't double post what I mean by that is like um, if someone already says like they want fly mod don't don't say you want fly mod too. just like like their post so I can see how many people like that and I'll do that or I can just do um, buttons what I mean by that is I can press the escape menu there will be a button right here that says commands click that and then there will be a menu and then um, it'll give all the commands so um, oops let's show us the mod okay so see how I'm I'll, I'm sprinting really fast it's pretty much it's pretty much it the reason I'm stopping is because I'm I'm not pressing the the button anymore and sometimes when you jump it stops it stops you from running but that's not a big deal um anyway guys uh this is pretty much the end of the video but um if you want to hear what else i have to say because i i think it's pretty important um stay tuned but yeah guys see you in the next video um but for you guys who's still here um what i was gonna say was um for the 30th video i mean 30th 30th subscriber i'm going to holy crap my hunger bar just dropped anyway for the 30th video for the buttons i was going to make it kind of like this and here's my senator client uh i think i already ha did a tutorial on this i'm not tutorial a video on this just to show you guys what it is but um oops oh also if you guys want um a retard mode for um the 30th video i can all i can also do that because i have that on my on this client and it was actually pretty easy i just um took it from private bots um it's not working on single player but it does work on multiplayer um, but yeah, I just took it from private bots and it works. But he didn't really did a do a tutorial on where to put everything. So um, if you want any specific tutorial for the thirtieth video, just let me know. Um, but yeah, I mean, I also have radar if you guys want to know how that works. Nuker does not work, so don't ask me for a nuker tutorial. But yeah, um, by the way commands so yeah here's how it's gonna look like commands and it'll toggle all this so as you can see there's an enabled right here x-ray works so yeah guys um if you want that just let me know or if you want any other specific thing um let me know as well and yeah guys i'll see you in the next video and um i released like this is probably like I think the third video I released so I'm gonna probably release maybe like another video because I'm gonna be pretty busy this week so you guys thanks for subscribing and all that good stuff thanks for all the su support and I'll see you in the next video guys see ya bye